Antonio, thank you for granting us uh, this uh, interview. Uh, tell us, um, overall, what are your first impressions uh, after a few weeks here uh, in Dinamo? You also managed to play a few, in a few games. How do you feel? Well, the, uh, the first uh, feeling when, when I arrived to, to this club is amazing. I, I found one amazing club with organization, with a future, with a quality team. And uh, with uh, an amazing fans, they are supporting the team during 90 minutes, and that's amazing for for us. So uh, the, the the feeling was was crazy from from the the first minute. Um, I know you spoke with others, you granted a few other interviews, but but please tell us why did you accept to come here to Dinamo? Well, uh, to, be honest, to be honest, I was waiting in Spain for, for a Spanish team to be closer to the, to the family in, in this window now in the, the winter. But uh, uh, I received the, the option of Dynamo and I couldn't say no because I, I knew about this club. It's a historic club in the, in the country, so um, I couldn't uh, refuse the, the option. You're uh, also one of the players with a lot of experience. You see, you have a lot of youngsters. Do you have to some also to teach some of the youngsters because you have some uh, some background. So yeah, the um, the the players with experience are very important in the team because we have a, a young young team. So yeah. we need to to help him to to help them to to. To, to find his his best best uh, shape, and uh, we are the the experience in the football because we are older. So the the mix between the younger player and older player is very important for us, and it's, it's great. How do you see the level of the league until now? From what you saw, how do you feel the level here in Romania? Uh, I found uh, one amazing uh, level because we played against uh, the the most important team in the in the country. So uh, were very difficult games with with quality players, with intensity, great atmosphere in the in the stadiums at the stadium. So at the moment was was perfect. I know you have a lot of experience here in Spain and you also played in England, but what do you feel the main difference would be here from uh, the West you know, in regards to football? Uh, I, I don't know. Maybe uh, in England they have a lot of money. They, they have the, the best player in the, in the world. So it's normal that the, the quality in the, in the player is, is, okay. is different. That, that's normal. But uh, after the, the intensity in the football is more or less the, the same, the, the players now are very, uh, very prepared to, to compete every game and, and the level. The difference is the, the quality, of course. You have also a Spanish-speaking player, a colleague, uh, so Antonio, you, you managed to, uh, to have one, one another because you came uh, to the same... Yeah, we have also Javi, nutritionist. Uh, we are speaking all the time, but uh, now the, the, the group is amazing with a mix of young player and yeah. old player and uh, we have a, a big family there. What are your first impressions of Dinamo fans? You also saw in the derby against PCSB, 45,000 fans, how do you feel? It? Well, I, I said uh, after first game, when, when I came, after uh, CB in the in cup game, and was was amazing because we didn't we didn't have the best uh, game, yeah. and uh, they were supporting uh, all the time uh, during during uh, 90 minutes. So it's not uh, easy to find one uh, one uh, fans like, like this. So I'm very grateful, and I, uh, we need you. We need you uh, all the all the games. From a physical standpoint, how do you feel uh, now after a few weeks of training? Also, you played. How do you feel physically? Mm, uh, I, I feel much better. I feel much better after first uh, month here. Of course, I'm not the 100 percent, 
But uh, I feel ready to, to play when the, the coach uh, decides. For sure, I have to, to improve. I have to um, to have more precision with the ball, uh, to improve my physical uh, shape. But I, I feel I feel very ready to, to play. The end of the year will bring you seven games in 30 days, more or less. Uh, there will be a lot of games. Yes, now we have. Uh, we have the opportunity to to play if the the coach uh, wants. He he decides. Uh, we are uh, all the players ready. We don't have uh, injuries, so we are we are ready to uh, to play this 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 game. And I know it's a bit early for you, but uh, how do you see Dynamo chances to to reach the playoffs? Uh, now in the last uh, games. We show that uh, we can compete uh, versus all, all the teams. We are in the at the top, and uh, now we have to to keep uh, this position and to play with personality. We have the quality players, we have the fans, we have everything to uh, to make one uh, amazing session. So I, I'm confident about the the, the session in. For me, we can keep this top position. What's your impression about Bucharest? To be honest, I, I don't know the city because I didn't have uh, time to to know the city. But uh, I think it's a great city. The traffic is, <laughs> is crazy. I have never seen something like that in my life. But uh, I have a good feeling about the, the city, to be honest. Uh, at the moment, I'm alone here. I'm living alone. Uh, next week, I will receive the the visit of my my brother and my friend. And sometimes they they will come to to, to be to be here with me to, to enjoy the city and the the games. And well, in uh, our tradition here at Radio Dinamo is to send a send a message to Dinamo fans. The well, uh, uh, as I told you before, I'm very, very grateful to everyone for the for the support that uh, we receive uh, all the games. Uh, I would tell them that to keep this uh, attitude, supporting the the team, and we need them. So they are very, very important for the club, for the club, and for us, the the players. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you.